Samba. <laughs> the samba is the most lively and fun of all the Latin American dances. It originated in South America and it was the first Latin American dance to actually come into the Western world, into New York, in a musical in the 1920s. When you're watching the samba, you should feel like you're transported to the streets of Rio during carnival time. It's cheeky, it's bouncy, but above all, very sexy. The samba bounce action happens in the knees and it's kind of like a spring being pushed back and forward. It goes from one leg to the other, usually one and two and one and two. You get this nice lilt to the samba that makes you feel like you're into the groove of the dance. One of the first steps that we do that travel around the floor is called the promenade run. It's really important that you connect with your partner on the very first step. So you face each other on the one and then you continue down the floor on the two, three. One of the top tips you can do when you're learning a promenade run is to actually try and do it with your hands behind your back because that way you're making sure you're not pushing your partner along the floor. Now it wouldn't be a samba without a samba roll. You can do them in hold where you're facing just the same as ballroom or you can do them in shadow where you actually are standing behind the lady. The easiest samba roll to learn is actually the natural turn samba roll and that's where you're facing your partner almost in ballroom position and the guy has to go up on his tippy toes but have his hip forward as far as possible and his head back. And then you actually turn and do the second half keeping your heads in the same place so your heads are always towards the centre of the room. Now once you've mastered the natural samba roll, it's time to get a little bit more difficult so you can move on to the reverse samba roll. For a reverse samba roll, if you're doing them in shadow, it's really important that your partner is on the right side of your body. This time, both heads together are drawing a giant circle in the sky. The judges will be looking for a really smooth action. One of the most popular steps to be introduced in the samba just recently is the bachucada. Now the bachucada not only is a step in Brazil, it's actually a rhythm. In a bachucada, it's really important to get the feet right. It's a tiny little slip backwards, a rock forward, rolling through the ball of the foot and then a replace. And then you repeat on the other leg. But the key is to keep your body soft. If you tighten up, it will go stiff. The judges will be looking for a very strong rhythm in the bachicada, so whilst that percussion must be vibrating down below, it's smooth as silk on top. So the samba is a really sexy, vibrant, energetic dance. It's all about the rhythm, it's a celebration. It's important to have fun. I mean, who knows, you might even get a 10 from Craig.